Hello everyone, welcome to Simple Views and we are back with another video. In our previous video, we said something about the Windows 10 for phones and showed a demo, a uh, full guided tour to the uh, Windows 10 for phones on the on this Lumia 730. So there's a new update for Windows 10 that uh, the new build 10,051 and it has added quite a lot of features to the Windows phone and that's the Windows 10 for phones and it has actually quite new features some new apps uh, the promising apps which Microsoft has been telling about uh, since the launch of the Windows 10 uh, or the announcement done in the January so let's just uh, unlock the phone and here's the lock screen and the new start screen that's nothing new we still didn't find any way to load the background in the back I don't know what is stopping itself too so here you see this new back and search key it's now little thinner and looks quite good and also the new icons to the uh, the new icons in the notification bar that's a little uh, small or the new wireframe frame style uh, which uh, Microsoft has been uh, adopting uh, in quite recent times with the Windows 10 uh, desktop updates and those bigger screens so this is uh, our application and also this new feature uh, of uh, uh, which came in earlier update that you can hide your notification bar it works but uh, that doesn't works in getting it back so we have to do something either swipe down the notification bar or lock unlock the screen and you get that navigation keys back so a simple uh, update and also I found the transitions a bit smooth now and uh, seeing at the earlier build the transitions were something I called stiff or uh, not very amusing and so now it's it's quite good and transition works better so let's just start out with uh, the apps which we get in this new build uh, so first thing is the notification bar and it's actually quite smooth too the expansion the collapse it all works no frame drops in it and works good so same uh, so the apps aren't showing their uh, thumbnails that's something I hate about uh, this update and so let's just start with our first app that's uh, the phone app and that's this new layout all the uh, contacts and you can actually Tapping this icon would uh, give you the details about uh, the uh, about your contact and different things. So here's the speed dial which you have selected, and here's the dial pad. It's now a bigger, and you can actually swipe it down, swipe it up. So it's quite good. Uh, there's a new voice for it too, and good. It's quite good. So a good update and this new uh, options menu yeah. and the new voicemail your phone book is here so this is your phone book quite new something good actually i say and so next is the messaging app it also has the new uh, layout the circular icons for the photos and you can see here uh, you can see the photos uh, of your contacts which you have saved I don't chat with message now so it's a quite old days now so here's the settings all the uh, blocked message and different things you can actually start a new message so quite good have an attachment provide feedback you get this new when you type message you get this uh, new send key that's something I think same as what Android has and uh, looks looks a lot familiar and it's simple so a good update to the people's hub there 
and people's hub has got a lot lot good update that's like this is the in update and so you can have this groups what's new that's and you need to set up your social account and your contacts a different contacts you can search it well there's no uh, earlier there was a sorting uh, for uh, using the keys now you have uh, you need uh, you can search it and this little uh, triangle over here it denotes the alpha sign that the apps are in the alpha not not even in beta they, they are in alpha so it would lag it there, there are some uh, some rough edges though now too and it would be changed later so next app uh, is project spartan i would be uh, doing it uh, in uh, later minutes uh, because it's something uh, surprise for everyone so there's this new outlook mail and that's that's good uh, the outlook mail it's a, a great app yeah earlier you used to get a limited message and the you have to load uh, new messages again and again so now you get this long scrolling list yeah, you all the messages are synced and the phone and the layout uh, or the ui is quite great the hamburger menu is here you can have the settings over search the refresh and add a new mail you can actually write a new mail over here attaching files format that's quite new uh, the word word style of keyboard any if you want to delete a uh, message just swipe left or uh, something uh, I changed the setting here mark as unread so you can also change it here and uh, there's the setting uh, options and you can select what your swipe right or swipe left does so it was set to clear flag or set flag uh, I did it to mark as read or unread that's what I want so it's easier it's quite good and the next app which is um, the file explorer uh, we did in video and showed you the file explorer too but it has got some a good changes I would say a colorful now the folder don't seem white uh, they are yellow in color so it's not loading taking up some time so let's just uh, go to another app that's outlook calendar it comes uh, uh, with the new outlook mail and those are bundled as the same apps so here is our this is the, uh, your calendar all the dates are synchronized with it and you can add new uh, uh, any note to the calendar or anything which which works pretty well and that's good too so all over a good experience but with some rough edges at this as we say so there's this alarm clock a new something good layout and the option menus are now uh, well uh, well good uh, enough to be in say the calculator app it is now well sorted the uh, the fonts are pretty uh, well designed and thick too which can be seen and all uh, the decent menus so here's this uh, your app is uh, different you can have a calculator or a converter in it so you can convert all those uh, stuff uh, right there in total a good experience con concluding it with so now let's go to a new project Spartan browser that's a long rectangle there so here's the new layout oh, something what Microsoft has been talking about the new layout some uh, good changes to the uh, new browser or the new rendering engine and saying bye to the older internet explorer or just a bit farewell too and that's a good uh, 
loading i think there's some rough edges still there and some website lo uh, web pages load faster some slow this uh, rendering engine is uh, uh, in a test so yeah all you get see this uh, add to favorites uh, written it's actually which language has been used i don't know so you all get those settings uh, same settings as uh, which which is provided by the internet explorer and this is what i'm talking about see when you long press the back key so smooth transition that that's what i was saying a smooth transition something that that uh, what we want and a great that that's actually something great i would say that's actually something seriously great because we want that we want the smoothness we want uh, to it to be smooth and so yes that's all for the spartan browser a very rough and currently but also uh, rendering web pages uh, smoothly and there's this new maps app that comes with uh, windows 10 uh, also an universal app so this whole it also contains the hamburger key your settings your maps and uh, different you can search uh, your directions favorite and settings uh, where you can download the new maps and actually good and there's only this one icon this feedback nothing else so currently not loading maps we don't want to go anywhere so stop loading it and one thing that's something great about this new windows 10 is the new camera the camera is now something same as the lumia camera this the icons are now a little bigger but with a great change that's this hdr what uh, microsoft says about the new lumia camera 5 with those rich capture i, w I was actually pretty disappointed when uh, they didn't announce it for 730 but now it would come inbuilt in the windows 10 so all of the phones all of the windows phones would be getting this update the hdr and that that's a good uh, good sign of uh, treating every uh, every thing equally this this new also uh, the new layout which i would say and i'm quite happy with this uh, new hdr setting and quite good too so all in all that's uh, the new uh, build that's 10,051 for Windows 10 for phones. So now I leave up to you. What do you, uh, what do you think about this new update? How it performs? How, what are your thoughts? And let's just conclude our video here. So you cannot call it an hands-on review or any review anything. It's just a guided tour. Uh, the whole application, whole applications for Windows 10 are in alpha mode that's not even beta the alpha mode is just made for inside testing that's done in the firm or in the company so that's alpha alpha apps so it's expected that they won't perform better they won't perform as expected there's a lot of crash lot of uh, even when uh, we showed the spartan browser uh, it's actually the third time we showed it uh, it crashed many times so even when we loaded some page, uh, you uh, saw the only a white page loading. Nothing else was loaded uh, in a blogger uh, in a blog. So all in all, a good experience. A new HDR mode for the camera, new apps, a phone messaging people, new layout, a new spot in browser, old Internet Explorer would be set by any time. The Outlook Mail and Al Outlook Calendar app, the new Maps app, File Explorer, the Photos app the calculator alarms and different all all being a good thing a new layout new that's good also and you get this new settings to be done which can you can pin any settings on the uh, on your start screen there's this small uh, pinning icon so just pressing it and you would be pinning the new settings down so that's all uh, you we have seen this 8.1.2 it's all ready and 
this is what I think uh, would uh, start uh, the picture is looking clear for the Windows 10 for phones and that's the clear picture we are getting and so let's just conclude there are more updates in the future I would like to see Windows uh, 10 uh, becoming a great operating system so let's just hope for it hope you like our video uh, do uh, press that thumbs button down if you like the video uh, do comment uh, do write your suggestions your query or anything about us uh, your uh, what do you think about us what do you think about video do share with your friends who have the uh, lumia phones or windows phones and it uh, we are uh, running it up on 6 uh, 7 30 it's available for more phones now and we will do post uh, some new videos uh, or the browser uh, uh, inexperience of the browser and many videos so do subscribe uh, don't do not forget to subscribe us uh, this is sim reviews saying bye